Sup nerds, I've been working on this for a while. This is the definitive guide on what flavor of monster energy drink every single D&D subclass will be drinking. This is entirely scientific, not up for debate whatsoever. Let's go. We're gonna start this thing off with my boys, the Barbarians. Let's roll. First subclass in no particular order is Path of the Ancestral Guardian, and they are gonna be drinking Monster M100 Ghost. In order to help them summon the undead members of their family to help them in battle, these barbarians are going to have to consume large amounts of this green ectoplasm. Alright, second subclass is Path of the Battle Rager, and they are just going to be seeing red as they're only consuming Monster Ultra Red. Keeps you light on your toes, and just like a bull, you're only going to be seeing red after consuming this. Alright, subclass number three is Path of the Storm Herald. Being all about storms and wildness, they are going to be drinking Monster Hydro Tropic Thunder. I mean, sure, it looks like goat piss, and it probably tastes like it, but it's going to be giving you all the energy you need to be constantly throwing those lightning bolts out. Next subclass, Path of the Totem Warrior. Hands down, they are going to be drinking Monster Gronk. So yeah, the pigskin is obviously your totem, and your name is going to be Gronk, so very fitting for a barbarian. For all you wild magic barbarians out there, it is time to recover with Rehab Wildberry Tea. There's no shame in admitting that you have an addiction to magic. At least you're not a full-blown wizard. But hey, go ahead and enjoy a little fruit cocktail on the side. Another popular barbarian subclass, the Path of the Zealot, you're going to need a little bit of extra strength from Monster Extra Strength. You're going to need an additional pick-me-up all those times you drop to zero hit points and then suddenly decide not to. Barbarian subclass number seven, Path of the Beast, you're obviously going to be drinking Monster Dub Mad Dog. You're raging, you gain animal features, you're drinking Mad Dog, it makes sense. Last but not least, rounding out subclass number 8 for Barbarians is Path of the Berserker. They are clearly going to be pouring Monster Assault directly into their eyeballs. Nothing screams, click clank, here comes the tank baby, quite like chugging one of these and then going LARPing. So please, discuss amongst yourself in the comments exactly on how right I was on all of these. And don't you worry, I will be getting to all of your subclasses shortly.